Hey everyone, welcome to Watch It, Paint It. In this video, we're going to be unboxing the Wargamer Doom box. It's a very, very cool sounding name. This is a little bit like those subscription boxes I've been getting, similar to Loot Crate, or the model box is the one that I get for, for our hobby. This, however, is more aimed at wargamery stuff, which isn't my necessarily niche area. I don't play war games, so I'm quite excited to see what's in this. And it's also, it is a subscription box, but at the moment it's quite bespoke. That it's, it's one man doing this, he's just started it all up. I'm all for supporting um, small content -y providers working, you know, day and night to, to to do something for people and this is providing a box at the moment it's more like a gift box to some extent because it's sort of first come first serve uh he's got things that out of out of print products that you won't be able to get anywhere else war gamer accessories rule books i'm going to guess models maybe tools paints that sort of thing i don't know i've never opened one just a little disclaimer this one was sent free of charge so take that as you will it might make me a little bit more biased because i'm not paid for it the price is 21.99 per box and then it's 4.95 postage within the uk he will post overseas but it's going to go up like everything when we get stuff from the states it's expensive postage and it's the same going the other way but let's have a look let's see what you get as always because it's you don't know what's in it you've got no idea what's in it and that's a massive massive excitement uh, same as the model box that i get same as asset drop that i've got and the same as even loot crate you know uh, you if you've been watching these videos you've heard me say I, I used to get loot crate i don't like loot crate but this part i love this was no matter what even though i knew i was never going to be happy with the loot crate um the the suspense, what could it be, what's going to be in there was always super exciting. Now, I've not even taken off the outer packaging. Let's get rid of that because it's noisy because I didn't want to spoil anything and I wanted to see what the box is like. This is a very cool sticker. Wargamer Doom box, very simple, but I like it. Decent box, no damage. Fragile sticker was on the packaging, so it's going to arrive reasonably safe. Oh, little little bit of tape there holding it in. So let's, let's see. First ever box I'm going to get. Let's see what the sort of things you get. You get some paper and well, it's another sticker. He's got stickers. I'm liking these stickers. I like a little bit of branding. I know when you're starting off, things are going to be simple. I hope with all of these subscription things, Loot Crate's come a long way. I'm guessing. I, do, I wasn't there at the beginning, but the boxes are fantastic, aren't they? They look great. Bit of a waste to me. I always just want to bin the box anyway. So the fact they've done loads is irrelevant to me. So one of the things I did wonder is, are they themed? And this is themed, so I'm guessing they're going to be themed. I'll hold this up. If you would like to pause it and read it, by all means do so, but I'm not going to read it now. But it's an elf warrior theme. Little pamphlet. I always think these little bit of an introduction, a little bit of something about the box. I always think it's good. More packaging, very nice, very nice, very tidy. Keeps it a little bit safe, but it also just looks nice. It's nice to open that thing. So look at these models on sprues, which I do not have many of. I think I've just got some random ones I acquired secondhand. So I guess these are elven warriors. Little little faces. Nice. I mean, that's cool. Does that mean that's Games Workshop? Is this Warhammer? But it's uh, no, the bases aren't right, are they? So other games comes on, <laughs> come on sprues. No surprise. As I mentioned, I'm not a war gamer. This is going to be crazy weird stuff to me that I'm not going to fully understand, but I can appreciate having some elf warriors that you get to build as well. I mean, the quality of this looks really nice. I wonder, wonder who makes it. Wooden shields looks nice. Nice to me, but I mean, by all means, let me know in the comments below if this isn't good quality because it, it looks a bit, bit of work on the daggers, but it looks nice to me. The rest is pretty clean, not too many mold lines, something different. I quite like having these random shields and body parts. I use them for basing because I don't play these games. And then I'm guessing these are bases. I mean, it's cool sending it to me. I don't know anything about these things. Oh, Mantic. So is this Mantic Games? Yeah, manticgames.com. So at least I know where to go and have a peep for that. And I do like Mantic Games models. So there's some elves. What else do we have? We have Kings of War Mantic Game as well. Mantic Games. Should we pop him out and have a little peep? Or oh, oh, hang on, Elf King with Spear. That's what he is. It's a it's a pewter metal metal model. I do prefer plastic. Is that? Is that weird? I'm quite new to models, as you guys all know, but a metal one's just harder to paint. Is there a reason we've gone to plastic now? So he, he's cool. I like him. I like elves, actually. Maybe uh, Mark, who makes the box, uh, has realised that 
Elves and dwarves are sort of my thing, so he's picked the box well. Smart move. Can I open this one without cracking the box? I cannot. But this is, what does that even say? Thronopia. Thronopia. He's cool though. Is he an elf? About it. Oh, I guess he could be. Sorry, I don't know. I thought he, he looks like the mountain from Game of Thrones. Just a big axe instead of sword. Where's his hand? Oh, there's more bits to <laughs> there's more bits behind. You have to build this one yourself. So oh Thronopia. Blah 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 blah. You again, by all means, feel free to pause this if you'd like to read more about it. But that's a pretty cool looking model. I yeah, I like that. I always handy for me to have armor models. So then we've got some bases, which don't look like I mean he'll need one, so that's handy. Uh, I don't think the rest needed, but these are always handy for, for me. I I don't have spare bases, so I'm always very, very happy to pick up some more. Uh, another pamphlet. So what are we get in here? Ten Mantic Elven Spearmen, five Elf Inventory, one Elf King, and one Elf Axeman. Cool. So this is like a whole Elf Army. Can you, can you play this in a game? <laughs> Do you need the game? Can I play this? I don't know. What's going on? Somebody let me know in the comments below. But Oh, wow. So, a bunch more. Why were these in a box? What's going on? What does this mean? What are these? These elf spearmen. They're not the same as this one. Let's have a look. Let's get them both involved. No, these are bowmen. Ah, oh, these are the infantry and these are the spearmen. I see. So I've got like the beginning of an entire elf army. Can I play that in a game? Maybe one of those pamphlets will say. Maybe I just need to go and read through it. But that is everything in this box so i feel i feel like i can build an elf army that's pretty cool and for me just having all these bits is just super handy so that's enjoyable now i don't again i just don't know enough about wargaming to know if this is good value you'll have to let us know in the comments below 22 pounds essentially for what was written on that list it doesn't sound bad does it actually uh 10 5 17 models 22 pounds no, that sounds good to me. I, I can't imagine picking up this this amount of stuff for much less than that. I doubt that very, very much. Is that a dog? Look at that. So it's going to be crazy. There's, there's a... What is that? Somebody let me know in the comments below what that is, but she's going to like it because it's an animal. Well, this is cool. This guy's like collapsed as well. This is going to be... I mean, for me... I mean, you guys are going to let me know if I could build an army with this, right, and play some sort of game. But just these bits to put on bases. I'm really enjoying collecting up random, like, arms, and that looks like a body sprayed out on a floor. It's going to be next to some boss from some game. It's cool. I liked it. I enjoyed that. A couple of models for me to paint and potentially an elf army. Let me know in the comments below. Thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you again soon.